<laughs> hey everybody, it's Alicia from Dinky Do. These are my quilty friends on a Friday night. We had a question recently brought to Michelle about how many quilts can a can of spray base do? And we didn't know. So we thought, let's have a basting party. What's a basting party? Nothing, we just made it up. So we are going to see how many quilts that we can baste with one can and give you the knowledge. We'll do the square inch and we can figure out how many twin sizes that is, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but yeah, we've kind of prepped everything. Everything backed, ready to go. So we're just gonna do a time lapse and see how it goes. So yeah, as I said, we usually get together on Friday nights to sew at the shop and we decided with that one question to why not baste a bunch of quilts we had ready to go. So we had all the backings done, cut all the batting pieces and we used the 505 basting spray, which is very good. For experimental purposes, we did have one person spray the can throughout. Um, she didn't spray too much, she didn't spray too little. I did find when I did get to quilting, I had to do a little bit of a press on both sides, but it worked out pretty well. It does also help to have six people basting at the same time. It does make things go a lot quicker and it was a really, really fun time. Um, I also made a mistake and I missed one whole quilt, so uh, here's a picture of it. So that was another quilt we did with one can and back to spraying more with one can. So we are coming up to the end of the spray can and can you guess how many we were able to do? Um, I was surprised, but in the end, it was six quilts that we got done. So the six quilts were various sizes, which I will post in the description below, but the total square inches of all of the quilts was 26,765. I found a website that had some standard quilt sizes and based on that, I'll let you know how many quilts you can get done for each. For a baby quilt, which is 30 by 40 inches, you can spray 22 quilts. For a crib size quilt, which is 36 by 52 inches, you can spray 14 quilts. For a throw, which is 50 by 65 inches, you can spray eight quilts. For a twin size quilt, which is 70 by 90 inches, you can spray four quilts. For a double, full quilt, which is 85 by 108 inches, you can spray two quilts with a lot to spare. For a queen size quilt, which is 90 by 108 inches, you can spray two quilts with not so much to spare. And for a king size quilt, which is 110 by 108 inches, you can again get two quilts with even less to spare. So with all that information, is spray basting for you? I think it's personal preference. I'm kind of in the middle. I like spray basting for ease and fastness, especially when you've got a bunch of quilty friends to help you, but I do kind of like the old school using pins. Um, they can be a bit of a nuisance, but I, I like them still. So we're actually coming up to the end of our night. We were very successful. We were able to spray baste 15 quilts total, and it was so much fun. Thanks for watching. You can find more of our videos on our YouTube page. And if you're looking to add to your stash, which we all need to, you can shop with us at dinkydoo.com. Have a great day.